Hello, the day too hot off the press is this tweet which came out regarding the prescription of midazolam. Indirectly by Hancock, who was in charge, so he's currently responsible for ordering and, and telling people, telling care homes to use this method. Uh, and of course this, this thread has come out and it's... Um, an official data so it's a, 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 a website openprescribing.net and this well I'll show you that in a moment but the um, tells you about the pres prescribing spike in Magellan you can see it on the screen in a moment uh, on the GP database and it was driven almost entirely by injectable 10 milligram, 2 mil doses. Now, obviously, it's quite serious, and of course, we'll show you the uh, actual website, open, op, open prescribing. So you can see here they've done this. Um, they put in the required drugs, the Dazlam, and it shows the speed, this um, spike for most areas. This was about June time, June, July. This is how much it would, would have cost. So I'll try and link that down below so you can go and have a look yourself. The tweet that we have obviously is quite important too. And this is the UK's official prescriber database. What needs to happen now is an audit to, under, to see the to see the number of deaths in hair care homes. Uh, where midazolam use was high and obviously if they were gi be given midazolam instead of antibiotics then obviously criminal charges should be laid uh, but who created the policy well yeah it's a good point because obviously with Hancock in charge of the uh, Department of Health he should really ultimately take the uh, blame for that um, and obviously this spike, as I mentioned earlier, was for the injectable 10 milligrams. And um, I'll, read, I'll let you uh, read the words and um, make up your own mind about that. So this is for those claiming that these drugs were being used for ventilating people, a reminder that this is a GP prescribing database, so it's not used. Uh, prescriptions for pro propofol only used in hospital. So basically zero were used in hospital. This was the, the GP setting, the care home setting. As you can see, it goes on a little bit. Makes reference to Harold Shipman, because <laughs> he was another um, prolific offender and uh, yeah I think uh, it, it does go on basically as you can see it's quite in depth so what I'll do is I'll put the link down below you can go and read this uh, tweet uh, thread and make up your own mind okay so hopefully we haven't uh, contravened any uh, YouTube guidelines by uh, reporting this story but it's actually from official sources so that's all good we're not making any supp suppositions or any conclusions the actual data is presented and of course you have the choice of making up your own mind about it so there we go uh, and of course that's it from me. Have a very good day.